So I just thought it would be really cool for you guys to get an inside look at my 1973 Volkswagen bus, also known as the Joy Bus. So out doing a little solo camping right now and just have her all set up. Thought it'd be really cool for me to show you guys what's inside, what it's like. These are super fun things to drive. This is a 1973 Riviera, which means it's a company that was made in the United, uh, a company that's out of the United States. So it's different than a Westphalia. And a lot of the Westphalias have the kitchen inside. So what's nice about this is most of the time you don't want to cook inside and it just kind of can leave stains and odors and all that kind of stuff. So most of the time I cook out here. So it does have a sink right here, but the uh, sink's currently being used to hold all of my treats. Um, this is super cool to you guys down here is this uh, it's it's not a refrigerator but it looks like a refrigerator but you put the ice up top up here and then um, the idea is, is that the cold air drops down total circa 1973 generally wherever we go try to get some cool magnets for it and then uh, down here you guys you'll see got this original linoleum floor it's got a little gold speck in it total 70s definitely love it think that's super cool um, and then this is all you know the cabinetry and then we call this the coat closet and then we've got a little spot underneath the bench seat here this is my the Yeti 1400 this thing's awesome I'll show you guys all about that tonight when I when I turn it on but I like to have a little noise when I sleep so I bring this fan and we actually can plug the fan right into that no problem it's got these super cool lights but this is a great spot to store a bunch of things kind of out of the way um, and then over here we've got this seat and this seat is um, you know I got three kids and so being able to put all the kids in here with seat belts is really important so kind of got this seat underneath it's got a lot of my cooking stuff in it it's got my stove and uh, some pots and pans and things like that but then all over the place are these cool uh, tables or whatever you want to call them so this thing pops out so another spot to use and then underneath is another little cabinet here this is our dining room table this all folds down I'll show you guys that in a little bit um, but the bench lays flat two people can sleep there no problem and then there's a little storage area up here and then you can stand up and check this out so this is all original this is super cool original headliner still original um, nylon and then check out this super cool fabric this looks like one of my mom's old pot holders right here this thing's total threadbare but trying to hang on for dear life with that so two people can sleep up here what happens actually is right here this pops out and it makes it a little bit bigger so kind of a, a double bed maybe is what I would say uh, windows all the way around this one on the front actually opens up all the way hard to do a zipper with one hand apparently. there we go so this opens up and then you can see I got my firewood and stuff stashed out there it's kind of a spot that you're supposed to put your luggage and things like that um, in there so, uh, there's a water tank in here I think it's a 10 gallon water tank and then it goes underneath here into where the sink is let's see if we come around back here I'll show you guys so you guys all know that the motors in the back right so check that out that's just a reminder because people get behind me and they're like, why are you going so slow? Well, it's just because it goes slow. But uh, motors in the back here, that's an original motor from 1973. I think it's got about 90 horsepower or so. There's nothing else like a Volkswagen on how it sounds. Um, and then the back opens up here too. It's all full of stuff right now. It's a little house on wheels. Uh, which is super fun with it, but definitely wanted to give you guys the uh, the grand tour of the Joy Bus. There she is, in all of her glory. Well, I'm just about to hit the sack, but I uh, wanted to show you guys what this thing looked like. So you can see that the, the couch or the bench has laid down and got this nice bed here. I've got these super cool Goal Zero lights that are all connected. To that power unit um, these things will run for days without a charge you can see our super fancy uh, curtains that we use there's my fan the curtains are uh, the idea was what's the you know if you jumped magnum pi in the late 80s uh he was wearing a shirt and then 
we made a curtain out of those. That was the idea. So, anyways, it's a pretty tight squeeze in here, but it's definitely nice and cozy. And uh, gonna get some shut eye. Try to stay warm out here tonight. So, thanks for checking this out.